Hi one, hope you're doing well from whatever you're watching this channel, depending on your time zone. Now, inside 24 hours, in different occasion, William Samuel Ruto has met Raila Odinga three times with the latest one at Nyayo Stadium during the Masemeji. And uh, for the first time, while I was it was at Mukami uh, Kimandi Burial Service in Nyandarwa. Then from Mukami Burial, they went straight to Moi Sports Center Kasarani for Kipkeino Classic. Then this one of yesterday. Within 24 hours, <laughs> and people are raising questions. What is cooking? What is in the making? And suspiciously, Ruto has abandoned Rigande Gashagwa for this entire time. Within these 24 hours, he has not been close to Rigande Gashagwa. Remember, even yesterday, Ruto was in a church somewhere in Nairobi, but he was accompanied by Lindy Nyoro and other leaders, but Gashagwa was not there. But in a normal day, like a Sunday, you will see Gashagwa even accompanying Ruto to the church. This time, Ruto has distanced himself from Gashagwa. Because they could have proceeded direct to Nyayo Stadium. So I may take an Agashagwa, a kind of Kanisan. Katoka Kanisani, Kenya Stadium. Uko waliparana na Raila Odinga at VIP waiting area. Itona pale kuna baba na mamba, CS for sports. <laughs> then kuna Raila Odinga. So, at least in uh, Nyaya Stadium, the other time I can tell you, William Samai Ruto got a chance to sit with Raila Odinga on one-on-one, -on -one, what will we leave? Because in that IP, uh, VIP uh, waiting area, this is the time Ruto has sat down with Raila Odinga without Gashagwa. Or will he? People are asking questions. What is happening? If Gashagwa is missing, it means that they are talking, these two. And what could they be talking about? It cannot be just a coincidence that Raila was going to uh, Nyaya Stadium to watch uh, the Masemej Derby, then Raila Odinga, uh, sorry, and then William Ruto is also going there. Alam kwa mepatana pala kwa VIP. No. There is a possibility they just plan to meet there. And the people were, have been asking questions between Raila Odinga and William Ruto. Who will be the first person to blink? It is now being confirmed. Ruto is the first man to blink. It is clear from the previous photos and the videos we have seen to the latest we are seeing as of now. There's one thing that's emerging. Ruto is saying one thing that he needs Raila Odinga more than he needs Rigatha Gashagwa to run the economy of Kenya. There is a bipartisan dialogue that is going on. But we all know that in as much that bipartisan talk is going on, the only solution that can come out with the standoff we are having now in this country between Azimio position and the Kenya Kwan is only when Raila and Ruto can meet Oonge. And by the way, whether the bipartisan talk was going to agree or disagree, at the end of the day, if really there is a conversation that was going to continue, it was going to end in a meeting between Raila and William Samway Ruto. I don't know your views on this arrangement that we are seeing Raila and Ruto, they are enjoying time together, they are laughing together. Today even Ruto now is gaining smile. Ile smile mugonjo. 
mautoti so hivi ana smile anakaa ni kama mtu mwenye ako na afya this is the line that we have seen during the moi alienda huko kwa kanu huyo ni, ni Raila Odinga mwenye tumemuona during the kibaki Raila Odinga tumeona during the uhuru kenyata and now during William Samoei Ruto I would want to read your views tell me what is your view in this meeting between Raila and William Samoei Ruto inside 24 hours three times meeting what is cooking what is your view I want to read your comment tell me because even me now I am lost I don't know what is happening I want to know from you and maybe that's the reason why I have come up with this video just to know what is happening so drop your comment tell me what is cooking between Raina and William Samoei Ruto and who is the biggest beneficiary and what is the interest of Azimio in this and what could be the way forward for Azimio and Kenya Kwanza? What is the position of Rigatha Gashagwa who has been abusing and accusing number one, Raila Odinga. If you see Raila is talking to William Ruto, then remember, he's a man who has been protecting Uhuru Kenyatta even when they attack and loot his properties. He has been going there and has been defending Uhuru. What is the Dashagwa's position if Raila is talking to William Ruto? That means even Uhuru Ako Hapo. Is the William Samuel Ruto trying to chase Gashagwa near his government? And at least give an ear to Raila Odinga. Because it is very hard for William Ruto to welcome Raila Ako Hapo. Na Gashagwa yule mayana to sing Raila Ako Hapo. Because even as of late, people who support Raila Odinga have been seeing Gashagwa as an enemy because the manner in which has always been responding to Raila Odinga. There have been a lot of bitter exchange between the two. So he has been viewed as an enemy. And because of that, Ruto is understanding that for me to embrace Raila Odinga supporters is to keep aside Gashagwa and then Bring Raila Odinga close to me. This is what I'm seeing here. So get the Gashagwa candle, and I've come and I've come and I've Then from there you can discuss way forward. So the Gashagwa has come to the corner. This is one of the worst. They are serving term one. And this term one, already, we are seeing a division. It is emerging. And the first victim is the Gadda Gashagwa. Kuna wala lukua anasema watu wa onge. Mdavadi has no problem with the dialogue. Wetangula has no problem and anasema watu wa onge. Khalwane said that he is welcoming dialogue. But Gashagwa said that he don't need anything to do with dialogue. Ya kwamba Rael Uruta afanya kazi, ye ya tadili na yule mze, o achie ya tadili na mze. That was Gashagwa. Today Uruta is saying that no, me I need to talk to Raila Odinga. But not you. Before it was Gashagwa talking to Raila Odinga. But today now it is William Uruta talking to Raila Odinga, but not Gashagwa. There is a possibility that Ruto is trying to negotiate with Raila Odinga. And you know, we have had a heated debate in this country. From the Azimio side, they have refused to embrace William Ruto. And Ruto is learning that the only way to cool down this high temperature in this country is just by him. Walking close to Raila Odinga. 
Sitting down with Raila Odinga, embracing Raila Odinga, at least hug Raila Odinga, at least listen to Raila Odinga. Then those who support Raila Odinga will try to reduce the pressure. Remember, this also is coming at a time when we are going to have a bill that is anti-people, that we don't want to pass in the parliament. Raila Odinga, stand your ground. Don't change your mind. Stand with the people. Don't support that idea. It is better you even lose when you are with the people and Ruto win it without your input. That's my view. Iyo bini nakunye ni akugandamiza manaichi wa kawaida. Already a perception had been created that Ruto today has become the oppressor of Mamamboga, Boda Boda and the poor. Amekuja na bile yenye nasaidia matajiri wanunue mandege wafanda biashara yao. Amejile tatu mesikia. Lakini, that perception cannot change. Watu saizi wanataka wanunue ndege bila ushuru. Wewa wakununua pikipiki ushuru yiko hapo. Wewa wakununua gari ushuru yiko hapo. Watu wa matatu. Mwambaka wanatumia means of transport. So, he's coming with a bill and he's trying to make some friendship with Raila Odinga. So, Watu wanga kudivert attention wangea kuhusu Raina. Watu wanga kudivert attention wasi focus mambo ya hiyo bill. Alafu sasa rasa hapa. Antaka watu wazimia wanga kupigia kura hii bill. No. This one should be rejected. This bill is anti-people. And when Raila Odinga had issued a statement on this. And by the way, Raila was playing an, uh, he, was, he was playing opposition role. Very well to William Samuel Ruto. Oversight role was, was being played very nicely. Ruto come with this bill, Raila come with this statement. And then he whipped the emotion of Kenyans. Even at the funeral, Ruto was surprised to see Maon Kenya is celebrating Raila. But when he's speaking, it's like they are forcing to accept his speech. So he's changing the tune. I don't know if you see. But it is good to be meet in the comment section to continue with this conversation. Thank you and see you in our next video.